Don't be silly. How else will we spread the word to the unenlightened? So many misunderstand Adam and fear the glow of his light as a thing of destruction rather than humanity's next step toward perfection. With this marvelous holy water, they drink without fear, and by the time the glow consumes them, they have no need to fear ever again. You judge what you do not understand. By introducing them to Adam's light, we are saving them from a life of misery. I suppose it's a fair question. Ever since I was a girl, I knew I was destined for something special. I always resisted the feeling, me, special. But one day I fell asleep during one of the confessor's sermons, and I had a dream. A dream of the prophet of Adam, ablaze with holy light. He told me of my destiny, of my mission. I was called to service, and I answered. The only being able to convince me I was wrong would be the prophet of Adam himself. It was a gift from Adam. I was meditating right here in Springvale when four of his armored angels came to me. When I said I was from Megaton, they gave me barrels of aqua pura and said I should share it with my people. They were very clear on that. Naturally, I understood Adam's message. And so I've been busy blessing this holy water and sharing it with the world. You may not agree with us, but you need not mock our beliefs. The prophet of Adam would be so aglow as to outshine the sun. You are not he. May you know eternal light. Yes, my child? <gasps> Why, you are the prophet of Adam! I, I didn't recognize you until now! Your eyes are aglow! Your very skin radiates with Adam's heat! I, I didn't realize... Uh, my lord, now that you have revealed yourself to me, I do... Uh, I see the errors of my ways. Forgive me, for I knew not what I was doing. We will spread your word without the use of holy water. We will return the Aqua Pura to Megaton. It shall be a test. The worthy will seek us out, and finding us they will find the message of Adam, drinking the waters of light in their souls. Yes! I leave you now, Lord. I cannot bear to look upon your shining face any longer.
May the light be your beacon. Walk in Adam's hope. Is there something else? Cult? There's something about Megaton, isn't there? It's apparently THE place to start a cult these days. Hmm, guess I can start sending them water again. Hopefully they can keep their grubby hands on their shipments this time. Here. It's not much. Most of the assets have been exhausted, but take this. It's definitely worth getting lions off my back. <laughs> Thanks. Yes, yes, I received a message from her. It's here somewhere. And, well, no matter where it is, I know what it said. <sighs> the Initiates just finished itemizing a requisition of confiscated Enclave gear. There were a few items that we didn't immediately send out. I suppose you're welcome to those. The Brotherhood thanks you for your efforts. Now, if you don't mind, I think I'll just take a brief nap here at my desk. What have you got on your mind? Yes, by all means, let's! And I shall... There isn't someone else you could bother. Many of us keep asking that same question. The Brotherhood isn't a postal service. We have important things to do, and we need caps and technology to do it. Lyons is on some kind of mission. Has he forgotten about the Enclave? That's our priority. But yeah, things are being done to offset the cost of Lion's little pet purity project. Look, it's not that I don't trust you. I know you're trustworthy, but you see, that's just it. I don't think you're capable of discretion. Nothing immoral is going on, but... <clears throat> I'm already in a lot of hot water with the Brotherhood. I need to be careful with what I say and to whom.